having an incredible day so far. And um, maybe if you're watching this first thing, we're getting your day started off right, right? <laughs> okay, today we wanted to talk about the magic of the third piece, because I feel like um, a lot of times we're dressed and maybe we think that we look great and we do. We're, we're dressed, we look fine, um, but by just adding a little bit of something extra, we can take that look to the next level. And many times we think about this as a topper, and that's absolutely a third piece. Um, Amy and I are both going to kind of expand on that just a little bit more, but I'm going to first show you the outfits that I have here, and then I'm going to quick zhuzh them up. But I have our complete top in this hunter green. And then our Chargo, so you've got a column of co color here. I have our Charlie pullover, which, spoiler alert, if this is on your wish list, you probably want to get it sooner rather than later. This thing has been flying out the door. And our compass pant. And then I have our Soho jean and our Athena pullover. So, you know, fully dressed, ready to go do whatever. But look what happens when you add just a little something extra. So I'm going to add the Madame cardigan here to this first look. And that just, I love a column of color with a pop on it. I think that's fantastic. And then I'm going to take and add just our little scarf to the Charlie pullover. And I'd probably toss the tail over my shoulder or you could tie a little knot. And then on this last one, I have our twist belt. Never underestimate the power of a great belt. And gals, we provide one for you every single season. But just by doing a little front tuck, maybe cuff the um, bottom of the jeans, it adds a little bit different extra styling look. And then because we like to bring in our vintage pieces and remind you of the value of these, um, of the cabbie clothes, I've got our garden cardigan. And you can see how that just goes with the column of green. It really spices up the um, gray and then it goes beautifully with the red and the Athena pullover. So I can't wait to see what you've got, Amy. I love that. And I am sticking to kind of the idea of a topper and how it can change your different looks. So I'm all about florals and prints this morning, which is so fun. But I want to show you how you can ground down the prints and florals and make it a little more structured, a little more like not so florally. Also, it helps really you'll see a beautiful column of color pop out or it'll settle down a print mix. So the third layer or the third accessory piece is really powerful. And I love that we're doing this because a lot of these are also wear now layer later pieces because it is still definitely hot in many places around the country. So I am starting with our flash bulb um, top, which is this beautiful satin piece, has all the colors in it. I'm pairing that to our Venice trouser that I actually am wearing today. Absolutely love these pants. The next look is our tuck top and I paired it with the Chargo because I want you guys to think outside of the greens. You can easily pair colors to the green. This is a great new neutral. Think of the grass, think of trees, think of everywhere in the wilderness in, in nature where you have green and you have color next to it, it does not have to be in the top. So I just wanna remind you that you can absolutely do a non-green top with the green Chargos. And then next thing we'll have a really fun print mix. I have paired our printed Cherish top with something I think is a little unexpected. I'm gonna bring it closer so you can see how cute this is together. This is our Passport Skort. And I feel like the black and white in the skirt really balances out and pulls out some of the grays in the top. And they're two completely different prints, different scales. And so I love this print mix together. Now I am going to focus on the most beloved uni jacket because it is my favorite. I love the classic structure of it. And you can see how it's really going to pull together 
both the Venice trouser and the top and really kind of dress it up with that velvet look. It's going to be a great topper that's going to create a beautiful column over top of the chargo and the flash and the um, tuck it top. And then on this one, it's really going to kind of ground down and bring that print mud mix to just a very minimum piece. Now for my vintage piece, I wanted to bring back another top because I think we have a lot of these in our closet and it's really fun to see how they can be worn back with that third piece. So this is the Lark top. It's going to go fun with any one of these bottoms, including the Passport Skort. And you add that green topper to it. And again, it grounds that print down and makes it very wearable, even though the green is not in it. So the third layer, the third accessory, the third piece in general is very important to your wardrobe. You don't have to have it all, but you can definitely do three, right? So whether it's an accessory or a scarf or a jacket or maybe a fun, brightly colored shoe and bag, it's really fun to add to and complete your outfit. So stay tuned next week. We have some really fun videos coming up. We're really getting into the depths of the collection and getting to know it even better ourselves. So we can't wait to bring you all the fun that we have in store. So that being said, stay stylish and have a great day.